What's up, YouTube? It's me. I know. I am a terrible YouTuber. It's true. Where's the content? Where have I been? What's my excuses? Because I don't have any. Yep, that's exactly right. I don't have any excuses. I mean, I've been busy, but... I'm always busy. That's just the way it goes around here, so... Let me fill you in on where we've been, because... We're not sleeping out here, people. I'll tell you right now, we're not sleeping out here. Basically, a lot has happened in a little amount of time. I don't think I've posted in at least a few months, and I am sorry. I apologize. And I am dedicating myself to YouTube, trying to be weekly to at least every other week uploading at least one video. And not all everything has to be car content. I would love to branch out a little bit, try a few, uh, I don't know, ulterior ideas. Because as much as I love cars, it doesn't have to be cars 24-7. I'm a very creative person, and I got a lot of ideas flowing through me all the time. But this is mainly a car channel. So what have I been up to? What have I, what have I been doing? A lot. House projects, of course, you know. That's a given, buying your first home, fixer-upper. They're just kind of like never-ending. Almost like cars. Just is one thing after another. So, got a lot going on on that aspect of things. And I don't know, maybe I might start like filming some home improvement stuff. If you guys would be interested in that, let me know. But, I don't know, because I kind of started out with the idea of just strictly a car channel. It's been mostly cars. But, with that being said, on that note... There has been some stuff going on. Cody's Blazer with uh, 358, I think, 358,000 miles. Eh, whatever. Something like that. Basically 360, 350, something like that, 1,000 miles. That engine, it finally, it's, it's done, basically. So, I didn't film the taking it apart i'm sorry that probably might have been interesting to some of you maybe not for others but we are gonna re we are gonna film the rebuild of the engine and all that and i will explain more in the rebuild engine video documentary so other than that uh my wife's car's gotten a little work i'm gonna be doing a little bit more work on that um, the Mercedes, <laughs> of course, I bit off more than I can chew when it comes to that thing because I'm just super OCD, basically, and I want to make everything super perfect. So it does run and it does drive, at least back and forth out of the garage, but I did run into some issues. I had a couple leaks that I had to button up because, well, let's just say I forgot a little RTV in a few spots and kind of screwed me up so I had to pull the tranny off I had to reseal that stuff not a big deal it's good now so just have to finish putting that together I got a new steering wheel for it it's just the buttoning up people so we're gonna finish up <clears throat> and it's never finished but we're gonna get further on that project real soon Levi's Velocer it's been pretty much doing fine but he needed some suspension components so i think i might be got a couple clips of doing some tie rods and whatnot you know a little bit here and there and then his hood is just botched so we have a hood painting video we're gonna do coming up soon and we're gonna be spraying out a spray gun i think I, I, I hope if levi buys the fucking color match rattle cans i don't know man i'll just tell him don't do that but if he does it, we'll see. Anyways, so we got the hood painting video. That'll be coming up. And, yeah. I don't know. I guess I should try and keep this as short as I can. Because if I'm going to add in some clips of what we've been doing. And I've been talking for whew, 4 minutes and 45 seconds. Alright. I'm going to see if I can make this any shorter. And if I can't make this shorter, this is going to be the clip I run with. So... I don't know if that, uh, yeah, there you go. 
What's up, YouTube? You know how we doing it. Yeah, we out here. It's late. It's dark. You can't even see what we doing. We but we out here. Hola, amigos. We got Cody. We got a Blazer engine. There ain't nothing left. So that's what's happening. This is how we start in the video. We back out here. What do you got to say, Levi? We need to get it done. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. We get it, whatever he mumbled over there. What do you got to say, Cody? Got it done. Got it done. Now tell him, the, tell him the struggle. Took me a little while, but this is way more than I thought it was going to be. Compared oh. to watching Chad do his four banger. Hey, this is easy to six on it. Yeah, fair. Know, fair, but my four have been way easy. Mm -hmm, yeah, so much extra steps and trying to take off one thing, you gotta take off four things. It's just oh, terrible. Yeah, but know, we got it. It's done. Ooh. So what we got going on here? Blazer build coming soon. Engine We're gonna swap. be doing uh, a lot of the extras on her, uh, getting it dialed up. Maybe like a weekend dragster. Who knows? And Levi's Velocer? Up next. Hopefully. Up next, yep. Oh, the board's uh, on. The board shift a little bit? Oh, it looks good. It looks fine. Yeah, yeah, now it's good. Yeah. It's, it's, the crane's still got a lot of pressure. Oh, okay. Oh, no, go ahead and get it back there. Yeah, the front sure. was a good area. Maybe we're going to do it from the back. Yeah, yeah. Get, get yeah, you need to start. Yeah, no, yeah, you get out of here. 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 Okay, so I'm working on stripping down Cody's block. Figure out what happened. As of right now, it's been sort of cleaned. Because I didn't want to bring it in my garage like this. But yeah, I'm basically just going to strip this thing apart. So I'll put this on a... Uh... Yeah, I ain't going to time lapse it. Okay, so we got Cody's block here. It's stripped down now pretty much to just a bare block. Intake's off, valve covers are off, casing's off. Oil pan's still attached though. We took the rockers and the rods out and no noticeable damage on those, no bent rods. So the mystery continues on what happened to this engine, but for now we got to make some room on the workbench to strip the rest of this down, which this thing is so slimy and gross. That's Cody's out here tackling the dirty work. Looking good. Yeah ridiculous how much sludge was on this thing but you'll get that on these jobs you know 358,000 mile whatever right Cody 358 380 380,000 mile engine oh my gosh I was wrong by 30,000 miles that's insane so definitely get, he definitely got his money's worth out of this thing and we're pretty much just stripping this down for science but maybe it's rebuildable who knows we'll see There she goes. Here, let's get a towel and wipe mm -hmm. up Yeah, seriously. Uh, <laughs> 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 crazy bad. I'm just like, I'm gonna have to move. Uh, 
You've just been exposed. No, I'm not. <laughs> it's too dark. <laughs> <laughs> We're outside. It's sunny. Say hi, Levi. Hello. <laughs> We're going to do a little Edelbrock Pro Flow on the Dodge Dakota, the truck that never sees any love on the channel. So we'll just do YouTube magic. And just like that, a shiny bit. This truck is going to need a whole lot more shiny bits though because it's looking a little rough. Gotta do the heart emoji. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh yeah. I'm no just way. checking. I thought honey, you know, the meat for sure. I don't know 